slide back with another video on Reckless. Okay. Why Democrats will vote for Trump. You feel me? Make sure y'all hit the like button, subscribe button. Uh, definitely, uh, I'm saying, learn a lot. Uh, learn a lot uh, from myself. Learn a lot from uh, subscribers. Uh, learn a lot from, you know, uh, videos itself. Yeah. Uh, links that people are sending. I know it's a lot of people in there saying this and saying that. Uh, a lot of people that's uh, possibly subscribing and stuff like that. Um, but I feel like those people, uh, uh, more so, uh, it's, it's a change. I want to know. Um, I'm, I'm still, you feel me, young. I want to know a lot of this. Um, Chris is, you know what I'm saying, obviously young, you know what I'm saying, and want a lot. I want to want to learn a lot of it. Yeah. Um, and on top of that, you feel me, uh, if you feel any different way from reacting to these videos, comment down another video. Uh, comment down a video that you think, because I've seen somebody has said something about, oh, you looking at a video from this person. Or looking at, so you take it upon yourself and you put a link down. Yeah, yeah. So we yeah, trying to react. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm trying to react. Chris trying to react to things that y'all seen. So if I see that somebody sent this video, we're going to be reacting to it. I mean, that's just, you know what I'm saying? I've, I've always done that. I've always been like that. I even go to community staff and say, hey, I got a list. You feel me? Comment down below with y'all. So make sure y'all do that. Y'all already know. Hit the like button, subscribe. Let's get a video. Millie Weaver reporting for Infowars.com. We've just arrived at the Akron Trump rally, and we're going to go see if we can find some Democrats that actually switched over to the Republican Party in order to vote for Donald Trump. I've always been a, an independent, and uh, I'm for Trump. So you switched over for Trump, or are you just here for Trump? I switched for Trump. I used to be a Democrat, but you vote them in and nothing gets done, and I want change, and I'm going for the change maker. I was Democrat, now I'm Libertarian, and I'm here because my wife wants me to be here. I'm here for Donald Trump because I can't vote for him. <laughs> and, and I want change, and I'm going for the change maker. I was Democrat, now I'm Libertarian, and I'm here because my wife wants me to be here. I'm here for so, so his wife and drug him there, you know what I'm saying? Damn. <laughs> I was Democrat, now I'm Libertarian, and I'm Bro, here because my wife wants me to be here. I'm here for Donald Trump because I can't vote for Hillary. I'm a registered Democrat. I'm a com committee chairperson in my neighborhood, but I cannot vote for Hillary Clinton. Well, I'm a Democrat, oh, but I don't want to vote for Hillary because she's a big liar and she won't fight for our country, and Trump will. I'm just glad we're getting someone in here that's going to do what he says he's going to do. I'm here for Donald Trump. I am, yes. What party were you affiliated with? I was in my mid-30s to early, maybe early 40s, I was uh, voting as a Democrat. What, what made you switch? Um, I really love this country, and the Democrats are doing us absolutely no service. They just tax the, the job creators, and um, rather than helping our country, they, they're taxing the job creators. 100% Donald Trump. I don't care about the Republican Party or the Democratic one, to be honest with you, but Trump 100%. And what did you vote in the past? Uh, Barack twice. First time I could vote was 2008. So what made you switch over? Uh, I don't trust the Democratic Party or the Republican one, for that matter. I probably wouldn't have voted if Trump wasn't running, but he seems like a cool dude. Knows what he's talking about. I can get behind it. I'm not part of him. He's just like, I don't care. <laughs> oh, God, he got an I don't care attitude. You know what I'm saying? A lot of these people, you feel me, uh, and, and that's what I like. Uh, you have, uh, you feel me, differences. Uh, you have differences on why. But see, yeah, because he's not even caring about Republican or Democrat. He's just, yeah. he said he's just there. Yeah. Cool dude. Knows what he's talking about. I can get behind it. I'm nonpartisan. I'm independent. I am voting uh, for Donald Trump because I need a constitutionalist in office and somebody um, that's going to put restrictions on the pro death, pro choice movement. I had an abortion and it's a baby. So we need to take care of that and help the women that are in crisis pregnancy. And this is the better choice. So. Were you ladies Democrats? Yes, I was. I'm voting for Trump. So Trump uh, converted you? Well, I like his policy. I don't like Hillary Clinton. Yeah, I voted for Trump. I've been a Democrat all my life. And so what brings you out here today? What brought me out here is because Trump say, Trump is talking just like half over half what the American people feel like. We're tired of the way the country's running. It's, we're not, we don't help our own. Well, we can send billions of dollars across the world for everybody else, build towns for them. Well, what do we have here? 
Amen. We have nothing. Yeah, we're losing. We're giving. We're giving away everything. We even sold the Statue of Liberty. You know, since he brought on Breitbart. So, the, so, so I feel like uh, a lot of people. You feel me? Yeah, exactly. For for I guess the the working people. Uh, so I I feel like a lot of a lot of people. What I'm seeing for right now is, you know what I'm saying the, the the working people and why they why they don't like the Democratic Party. Um, because okay, so uh, so I'm learning. You know what I'm saying we, learn yeah, a little bit. We even sold the Statue of Liberty. You know, since he brought on Breitbart, all the left stream media is trying to say that Breitbart is peddling conspiracy theories. But really, Alex Jones was the first one right. to really try to uncover all he this corruption. Right. And Donald's kind of the voice of, you know, that, I won't call it conspiracy theories, but what's really happening what's with really all this happening. corruption, Clinton right. Foundation, all the stuff Alex has been talking about, now it's getting mainstream. So I think it's amazing what you guys are doing. I'm here for Trump. And what party did you used to vote for? Well, um, she got the pink hat. Well, back maybe eight years ago, I, well, I voted for Bill Clinton. Big, big problem. Very sad. <laughs> so you feel uh, like you made a big mistake there, having voted for a Clinton? Absolutely. NAFTA has taken the jobs out of the country, and the Trans-Pacific Partnership will finish the job. So you were a Bernie so, supporter. So people, so people, people. It looked like people are. Some people also are mad at the fact that a democratic party would say they'll do something and don't do it yeah because they're not really doing anything and then it's like somebody else will come to office and they're like okay well this person democratic party let's see you know what i'm saying and then they, it's another mistake made they're not yeah. feel like they're doing it so then that's why a lot of people because i mean um, i don't know uh then i had people in the comments in the last video oh she tar she targeting these certain individuals and and paying like some crazy shit that you know what i'm saying i i, I want to know and, and 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 if if a person could say that about all oh, she's targeting and she's paying these people to say this and this is this is happening these people aren't really weren't really democrat can somebody show me a video literally a video of republicans switching to democrats i literally i am open to react to anything like i said in the last video i'm independent i kind of know what is leaning towards Chris, I don't really know. I can't speak for nobody else. But at the same time, like, how are you feeling about this, like, overall? I don't know. I feel, I still feel like I'm, like, independent, obviously, but. Yeah. Um, and that's, and that's cool, though. I kind of know, like, what, like you said, I kind of know, like, what I'm. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Because I'm learning stuff every day, so it's not, like, all the information I get every day is, like, okay, I don't know, making more sense, so. Yeah. Like, I kind of know. And like I, like I said, like. I'm 25. Chris is, you know what I'm saying, about to be 24. Damn. Still 23. I know. Um, about to be 24. Um, and, uh, <laughs> uh, you know, want to learn these things. I feel like it's important. Um, I definitely feel like it's important. Um, you know, we, we're on our second child. And these are things that that's, I feel like important. Um, so, if it's a video like that, make sure y'all comment down below. Don't be so mad, you know what I'm saying, in the comments. To it's it's okay to argue, tell your belief, but I want to see those videos too. What you think is the right video? You know what I'm saying? These are videos that's requested. These are videos. So, country you know. and the Trans-Pacific Partnership will finish the job. So you were a Bernie supporter then? Yeah, very very hardcore Bernie supporter. Yeah. And so I know a lot of people that were coming out to support Trump. Yeah, of course. Trump. We can't go for crooked Clinton. We can't go for go it. Trump. Yes, go Trump. go Trump. Make America great again. Yes. Can you can you say ex Democrats for Trump? Ex Democrats for Trump. Yeah. <laughs> so what brings you out here today, Donald or the Republican Party? Donald. <laughs> I like that he's not a politician and I like, you know, I think he can do good for us if we give him a shot. Did you used to be a Democrat? I did. <laughs> Up until Hillary. So did you vote for Bill Clinton? I did. <laughs> How do you feel about having voted for Bill Clinton? Uh, somebody needs to kick me in the butt. <laughs> for voting for Bill? For voting for Bill mm -hmm. and Obama. <laughs> oh, my. So you're embarrassed that you voted for them? I am, very. Mm -hmm. Well, I'm old, and I've seen a lot of stuff, and I think Donald Trump can make the difference. What party did you used to vote for? I was Democrat. But I voted for, well, I go way back in the Nixon days. 
Nixon Day. Bro, I ain't the smartest. I ain't the smartest, you know what I'm saying, dude. But I'm looking in the background is like see who all, you know, I, I, I like to see basically who is at these uh, uh, rallies, who's at these, you know, uh, what do they call them? Like the, the, I don't know, shit, I'm new to this. Um, but I, I see. Uh, Could make the difference. What party did you used to? I see Africans, you know, I see Africans. Um, I seen uh, African-American, uh, seen Mexicans. I've seen so many people that's been, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I want to know, I want to know deeper on, on why. I, I like I like to know why. Um, I feel like that's, that's oh, important Ford. too. I was a Democrat, but I voted for, well, I go way back in the Nixon, <laughs> Nixon days, but I just think Donald Trump's, I think he's the answer. Um, Hillary, which I do think is corrupt. I think the government's corrupt. And I think he can make a difference. I'm registered Democrat right now, but I'm definitely voting Republican. Democrats went downhill. And what party did you used to affiliate with? The Democratic Party. I wouldn't go back to him now. I'm her sister. I, told, I talked her into becoming a Republican. I told her, I said, Democrat, Republicans are what Democrats used to be. And when she went to her mm. doctor, was talking about Obamacare, he said the same thing. He's a Republican, but he used to be a Democrat. Democrats, Republicans are what Democrats used to be. So you used to be a Democrat? Yeah. So, so this is this is mainly what I what I was talking about as well um, in the past videos is that a lot of people would listen, like she said, her doctor. That's my sister. She listened to me. Um, a lot of people would would listen. You know what I'm saying to. I don't know. I feel like it'd be like a, di a different circumstance. You know what I'm saying? Um, rather than people doing their doing their own uh, research, uh, I feel like that's something that's important. So um, doing yeah, definitely doing your own research to do. Um, and and you know, even if it is some, I mean, shit, we all individuals. Um, we all we all uh, you know, adults. So you have a choice. You always have choices and shit. I, I guess that's her choice. Yeah. You know what I mean? Said the same thing. He's a Republican, but he used to be a Democrat. Democrats, Republicans are what Democrats used to be. So you used to be a Democrat? Yeah. yeah. And what? Democrat. Are you here for the Republican Party or are you here for Donald Trump? I'm here for Donald Trump. <laughs> Amen on that. <laughs> and so, uh, what do you like about Donald? I just think he's going to change. Democrats not doing it, so I changed. <laughs> so did you vote for Obama? Affirmative. Did you vote for Bill Clinton? Affirmative. Do you feel How do you feel about having voted for Bill Clinton? Um <laughs> It was so-so and same with Obama. Uh, it was really not that good, you know, but it is what it is. We make mistakes and we learn from them. We get wiser and older and pay more attention. You know, I'm almost 40 years old, so everything is just hitting me. Things that's going to affect me, my son who's graduated out of college and my 15 year old daughter coming up. So things that's really going to affect them. So now it's mm -hmm. time for me to step up and really. So you're like, you're excited about. See, your I feel like that's that's a that's a cool real answer too. Yeah. You know what I mean? Like I, I said, that's that's real important uh, to know. Even going, you know what I'm saying, Democrat or Republican, like, that's something important for your family at yeah, the end of the day. Just thinking about your family and, like, it's, important Yeah. Coming up, so things that's really going to affect them, so now it's time for me to step up and really. So you're, like, you're excited about your kids being able to get jobs and those opportunities that Donald's talking about. Affirmative. That's the main key. We're Latinas and we love Trump. Did you always affiliate with the Republican Party? No. We were, I was always a Democrat. I think this is the first time she's voting. I changed because Democrats took, got out of their platform and they're pro-choice. And that's just ridiculous. I love life and we should praise life. It is a gift to us all. And Republicans have God on their side. And I want to support America and military men, regular Americans, all Americans. Doesn't matter what ethnicity you are, what race you are, 
or anything. What do you have to say to people trying to call Donald a racist for bringing up illegal immigration as a problem? Well, we're Americans here first, always. And me being a Mexican and having illegals come in here is going to suppress the minorities here in the United States by causing wars with the um, African Americans and, and uh, Latinos for jobs. So yes, every other nation has to come here legally. So yes, I want that wall built. Are you here for the Republican Party or are you here for Donald Trump? Donald Trump. What party were you affiliated with? Originally Democrat. But not no more. Trump is number one. What brings you out? The Republican Party? I wanna I wanna see I wanna see a video as well, uh, about why the younger, you know, generation all the younger generations are voting for Trump or voting for, you know, I, I want to see why? why both parties. I want to see uh, both individuals. I want to see I want to see why, you know what I'm saying? Joe Biden. I want to see why I want to know. I want to know a lot of this younger generation. If somebody got a video of that more Trump is number one. What brings you out the Republican Party or Donald Trump? Donald Trump. Because He's the best one for president, and I w couldn't vote for Hillary for anything because she's a thief and a liar, and, there, and she's not for our country. She's only for Hillary, for money. Exactly. And what party did you used to affiliate with? I would go back and forth, whoever was the best candidate at that time. So I was an independent, but now mm. I'm a Republican. Mm. I'm actually here for Donald Trump. I've always been independent. Damn. And I just looked at whatever's the best option for everybody. And as far as I can see, in every way I looked, it was always Trump. And it was never Hillary, so just making that clear. I am here for Donald. Uh, what do you like about Donald? Uh, well, I just like that he's straightforward, that he knows how he's going to accomplish what he says he's going to do, and that, you know, I believe that God is for him, so I'm for him. What party did you used to affiliate with? None. I was always independent. Yeah, we're watching for wars all the time. Millennial Millie, right? So a lot of these people were independent or switching back and forth. Hmm. What party did you used to affiliate with? None. I was always independent. Yeah, we're watching for wars all the time. Millennial oh, Millie, right? Mm. Yeah. I love it. I love it for wars. Yes, I do. So it looks like we found a lot of ex-Democrats and independents here out supporting Donald Trump at the Akron rally in Ohio, which we all know that Ohio is historically a swing state. So it's interesting to see that <laughs> Donald is raking in the Democrats. This is Millie Weaver reporting Shit. for Infowars.com. My fault, y'all. Allergy season. Boy, oh boy. Make sure y'all go subscribe to uh, Half and Jay. Know my people, Half and Jay. Just talk to Half, you feel me? Nice guy. Make sure y'all also go subscribe to my cousin. That's Retro Steph. Make sure y'all go subscribe to him. Nice guy, you feel me? That's kind of crazy. Both of them popped up. Yeah. Make sure y'all hit that like button, subscribe button. Definitely was an interesting video. Make sure y'all comment down below more videos uh, to check out. Rather it's yeah. Democrat like or Republican. Yeah. I feel like it's it's pretty cool. It's um, like real people telling you how they feel about it. Exactly. So you don't know how I feel about it. Yeah. Thanks. Definitely, definitely lit. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you have to like with that subscribe button. More videos, please comment down below with a link or go to the community stat. You know what I'm saying? Check it out. You already know. Catch y'all next one.